Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Hank's Quest. And before I uh, check out the rest of the hall here, let me just real quick, uh... Here we go, okay. I figured there had to be some way to look at this, I just was using the wrong words. Let's see. Some classes are cancelled. Right on, you'll be home early today. Hmm, there's much more. Uh, keep reading it. An announcement for the teachers, tomorrow at 4pm, report meeting. I feel a bit uneasy. Yeah, they're gonna probably talk about how much of a loser you are. Hey, that's funny. There's a picture of Paul's party. But what's with the boy with his pants down? He was having the real party there. Warning. The caretaker will seize all Pokemon collections that are brought to school. Trading on school grounds is strictly forbidden. Dude, ain't that the fucking truth. When the Pokemon card game was out and hot and everyone was playing it, especially for me back in like middle school, they were not allowed on campus. We fucking brought them anyways. And when they tried to take our cards, we were like, fuck that. You, you can fucking send me to the principal's office for all I care. I'm not giving my cards because they would lose them. Because it happened to some people. Never happened to me, though, luckily. Anyways, <laughs> you decide to leave yours at home in future. In future. The future? In future. The board of directors have decided that bikes, which are parked outside the bike stabling, will be removed. That doesn't seem right. What? Then why have... I don't know. Hey, look. Today's timetable. Let's see. It'll be a short day today. You've only got two classes to attend. First in room 14, and after that in room 22. Oh, that was actually very important. Sweet. Um, and then it just loops through. Okay, cool. Uh, we'll continue to alternate temp saves. Uh, okay, so 14 and 22. So, uh, what's going on, cool kids? You're in one of the hallways of this school. There are some students here, which you call your friends. I call them friends, but do they call me friends? Talk to friends! What's- oh. Hiya, kids. I'm having a party at my place tonight. Wanna come? Do we know you? Is their reply. I mean... Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, no! Ah, I, I overshot! <laughs> Talk to the kids. Could you please be a bit more accurate? Alright. The, the boy in the far left is Don. The boy in the middle is Bobby. And on the right, there's Andy. Don, Bobby, and Andy. Bobby. Uh, yo, you guys look kind of cool. Hey, talk to Don. Donnie boy, what's up? Hank, I'm screwed. Wait, do I actually know them? Holy shit. Hank, I'm screwed. We're having a test today and I forgot to study. Sounds familiar. Talk to Bobby. Hi, Bob. How are you? Is that you, Hank? Damn, I can't see shit with these long ha with this long hair waving in front of my eyes. Want to come to my party? Free liquor? Gee, I don't know. I've got to... Er, hold on, Hank. I'll make something up. Er, I'll make something up. Oh, yeah. I've got to help my mom with her ironing. Okay, you answer, credulous as you are. Wow. He pulled the I'm going to wash my hair tonight. Uh, What's your name, Andy? Andy, my man! Hank, wow, man! How are you, man? I feel terrible. Damn, why don't you just say fine so you can be on your way? <laughs> Wait, what's up, Andy? That damn caretaker took my Pokemon collection, and I nearly caught them all! Come on, man, chin up. Maybe you can start collecting stamps or something. Hey, man, I'm no sissy! You're not completely sure that Pokemon are cool, but alas... Alright, hold up. First of all, fuck you. Pokemon are very cool. Back then, maybe it was more nerdy. Now, fucking, I think adults like Pokemon more than kids half the time. Uh, wait, let's continue to talk. I forget I need to do that for people. So, do you want to come to my party tonight? Sorry, man. I don't feel like it right. Uh, I don't feel like it now that I'm separated from my Pokemon collection. What if I get your Pokemon collection back? Then will you come? Yeah, sure. The collection is in the caretaker's office. I owe you, Hank. It's a fine. That's a fine mess you've gotten us into, Stanley. Is that a quote from something? I feel like I should know that reference. Hey, Hank, have you got my Pokemon collection already? No, I'm sorry. Oh, that's... That's okay. <laughs> no. Get over it, man. Get over it. Although, I'd be, I'd be sad, too. That's not how you spell Bob. Tlack Bob. So, Bobby. What? Or, who? What? Where? Who's there? It's me, Hank. Oh, sorry, man. It's the hair. It's... Yeah, I know. Dude, can I give him the comb and cream? So, Bobby. Uh, give Bob the comb. Here you are, Bob. Take this comb. Then you'll be able to see again. Thanks, Hank. Bob takes the comb and combs his hair. His hair... His hair budges. I thought it said bulges. 
Gee, Hank, I'm convinced. Now you can see again. Or now you can see again. Hallelujah. Bob, so, want to come to my party now? Count me in. Far out. Oh, hell yeah. Wait, can I give him the cream too? Nobody wants what you're offering. Oh, sh give, give Bob, uh, my, um, cream. All right, just jizz on Bob, okay? Just jizz on him. Just, just explode all over Bob. What? <laughs> all right, anyways. Hi, Bobby. Hank, my man. Thanks again for the comb. Don't mention it. Give me ten bucks instead. Ha ha ha. Very original. All right, cool. Wow, all right. So if I get the Pokemon collection, Andy will come. Bob is already coming, um, so to speak. And what the fuck was your name? I forget your name. Uh, Don. Talk to Don. Say, Hank, can I borrow that m and CD you've got? Damn, that's going to be a problem. Your little brother doesn't leave it out of his sight. Sure, of course, you reply. It's a fine mess you've gotten yourself into this time, Hank. Say, Don, want to come to my party? Yes, if you get me the m and CD. Wow, are they really your friends if they're only come if you give them stuff? Now you know for sure, this is a real friend. That's the that's the exactly counter what I'm trying to say, Frank. You're a Frank. Frank. Hank. All right, all right. Ayo, Donnie. Hi, Hank. Have you got that M&M CD yet? No, not yet. Don starts talking to Andy and Bobby. In Bobby. Uh, I guess uh, we're going to have to make two trips. I don't know if we can go uh, back and forth willy-nilly, but let's we'll continue uh, exploring the rest of here. Can I open the door? Why should you? You're not supposed to be in class yet. Oh. Well, all right then. At least we finally found somebody who wanted to fucking talk to me. This is the end of the hallway. This is also where the caretaker's office is located. Look, there's the, care the, the caretaker standing in front of his office holding a broom. Or, so, uh, sh or should I say, there's a broom holding the caretaker. He's so short. <laughs> Giggle. All right, let's not, let's not talk about being short. You're the one who couldn't fucking reach the microwave. I don't want to hear it, Hank. You loser. Pupils are minding their own business. The pupils. Something you should be doing as well. Talk to the pupil. Hi, guys. Are you busy tonight? Yes, we're going to hurl the raisins in the port. We're going to hurl the raisins in the porridge. I guess they're busy. That's weird. So, about them raisins. You don't have it. I guess I can't... Uh, I guess they're all just... One unit. Look at the caretaker. This caretaker made you sweep the schoolyard for many a time. With a toothbrush. To toothbrush, that is. Uh, does he have a name? Good morning, Mr. Caretaker, sir. Lovely weather we're having, don't you think? Well, well, young Fimo. Fimo? Uh, Fimo, uh, uh, I don't know why he's calling me Fimo. Young Fimo, have you been causing trouble again? Are you ready to clean the schoolyard? I ought to clean out your... Or, wow, hold up. I ought to clean out your wife, you mumble. What did you say, Fimo? Oh, uh, I I said I hate to be caught kissing a hive. Nice escape. I'm sure he fucking bought that. Wow, he was... Should have been plowing your wife last night. What'd you say? You heard me, bitch. Say, Mr. Caretaker, can I ask you something? If you really have to. When you were little, weren't you just a little bit afraid you were going to be short of income? I mean, your father was working at a tiny restaurant for a short while and had to pay a small contribution to this little tax official, just like anybody else. Wow, he's really trying to, to plow it in there, huh? My question is, isn't it just a little bit strange your father was cutting down on your food supply? What the? Young Fimo, are you pulling my leg? Not at all, Mr. Caretaker, sir. You refer to his height nine times. Nice score. You sh okay, you should give me nine points for that, then. Come on. That was the obvious time to give me some points, baby. How's the little one? What? I've never had any complaints from the women. Ooh, that's not what I was talking about, dude. I was talking about your daughter. Or, I knew that. You give us points now? Wait, how many points did I get? Hold up, I just saved. I want to see. How many points did I get for that? I got a single point. I'll talk. I tried to take the caretaker. 
you get a single point finally after after the end of all that after you shitting on his height that's a nice broom you've got there sir it's there to compensate no doubt dude we're just ripping on him hard take his broom what's he gonna do better not it will only upset the caretaker and trust me when i say that's not a very pretty sight um bang his wife He's not going to let me, I'm sure. Hey, young Fimo, get your ass away from that door, will ya? No. I refuse. Kick down the door. Show him who's boss. Um, kick the caretaker. Uh, I guess let's, uh, since we're done at this hallway, let's go into our first class. Uh, what class is this? In this classroom, German is taught. There are also benches, chairs, a desk, and a blackboard here. Look at the desk. There's a large desk in front of the classroom, which contains, that's nice, what well, contains, a drawer. On top, there's a duster. Sorry, I, I just always notice typos. It's just my thing. Many of these tables here are scratched over, written on, or foreseen with chewing gum. Yes, people live here. Uh, Look at the table. Wait, hold on, what was it? Uh, a duster. Take the duster? What? Why should you do that? I, to fucking, I don't know, mess around with the, uh, can I go back in? To mess around with the blackboard? I don't know. Look at the blackboard. This is a blackboard. Hi, blackboard! Uh, er er erase the blackboard. What do you mean by erase? Shit on the black... You understand that? Fuck! <laughs> there. Uh, can I read the blackboard? All right, all right, all right. You know what? Just uh, fuck you, too. How about that? Outside, the sun is shining. The sky is blue. Children are playing. In short, freedom! This is one of those rare moments you'd rather be outside. Can I look at the chair and, like, sit down on it? These are the seats on which the pupils sit when they're enjoying class. More like just trying to survive it. Why? There's no class at this moment. All right, well... These walls are here to prevent pupils from escaping during classes. <laughs> You've been wondering for years what the story behind that flag is. You've always wondered what the story behind this flag is. Every time you ask your teacher about it, he's always mumbling something about Fourth Reich or something. Alright, we're just gonna fucking leave this shit alone. Um, goodbye. Can I, uh, can I block you? Uh, uh, hello? Uh, sir? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Fucking power walking all these people. There's Michael. Uh, he's that irritating little maggot that follows you around all the time. Oh shit. Oh, no, uh, he's all up in my grill, man. He's gonna cramp my style. He's touching me. No! Oh, I missed what it- what? Fuck, I just saved. Hold up. Fucking, uh, restore. What were you saying? Hank, Hank, could you come by my place this afternoon? My computer is broken down. Get lost, Michael. You're in one of the hallways of this school. A couple of pupils make a nice setting. That annoying little maggot is very busy following you around the hall. He's not following me around the hall. He's very inappropriately touching me right now. Hank, have you played the new Chris Quest already? Is it completed then? Shing Bing. Wait, why? What was it? Shing Bing. Oh my god. Get him off! Get him off me! Hank, do you want to see the little one? I don't want... I don't want to see your little one. I have enough talking about it with the caretaker over there. Ah, what are you thinking, Michael? I'm not interested. Or, what are you thinking? I know my inflection is wrong sometimes. I'm not interested. I was talking about my babysitter. My baby sister, man. Babysitter. Baby sister, man. Er, I knew that. I don't know... I don't want to know why we got a point for that. All right, Michael is too occupied following you. Oh, oh my Hank, I love your new hairdo. Or, oh, I said that very weird, like, oh my Hank. He just said, oh my Hank, I'm loving your hairdo. Michael, get lost, you piece of crap. <laughs> I like how they capitalize piece of crap. Yeah. Piece of crap. Hank, let's walk on together. You don't mind, do you? Jesus, Michael, do I have honey sticking from my rear? 
Jack teaches Eddie and Jeff how to approach a girl without her running away. <laughs> you wonder why Jeff isn't paying much attention. Doesn't he want to get a girlfriend? He just doesn't care. Sorry, what were your names again? Jack, Eddie, Jeff. Jack, Eddie, Jeff. Hank, my mother wants you to come over for dinner. I'll bet she does. No thanks, Michael. I like to use cutlery while I'm eating. Uh, you're making me lose, forget the names. Hiya, Jack. What's up? Hi, Hank. What are you doing, Jack? I'm teaching these two bozos how to flirt with girls. It's a waste of time, Jack. Or, it's a waste of time if you ask me, Jack. It's a lot of bull, I'm telling them. When they use my advice, girls will be running away even faster. Ha ha ha, cool move. What a dick! Hank, Hank, get lost, Michael. Hi, Jack, I'm having a party. Wanna come? Sure. This is the first person who's coming... The first person who's coming without needing a bribe first. Also, wait a minute. Um, my inventory. Uh, the invitations. Invita uh, the invitations always come in handy when you've got people to invite. At this moment, you've got seven invitations left. Oh, shit, I need to give them invitations, don't I? Uh, give Jack invitation. Uh. Oh, no, wait. Uh, no, I've had at least two people say they were gonna come. Maybe I don't have to, uh, give them explicitly. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, here's your invitation, Jack. It's tonight. Cool, man. Who's coming? Well, it's a bit difficult to get people to come. Oh, bummer, dude. <laughs> There we go. Okay, so hold up, hold up. We've only gotten one person explicitly to come, uh, the, the dude with the hair. We need to get the Pokemon collection, and we need the CD for the other one. Okay, so that makes sense then. I already forget your name. Uh, Eddie? Howdy, Eddie. How are you? Silence, Hank. Be quiet. Jack's te teaching us the importance of courting a girl. But I was wondering if you'd like to come to my party. Jesus, Hank, be quiet. I take it that's a yes? Shut up! Relax, Hank. He's not worth it. No. Well, I turned the sound off. Can I talk to you for a sec, Eddie? Shush. Shh. Jeez. Does this guy suck or what? Hank. Oh, shut up, Michael. Oh, do I need to talk to Jack at all now that I give him the thing? It's going to be a hell of a party. Awesome. What kind of music are you playing tonight, Hank? M music, you say? You just knew you'd forgotten something. I just knew I'd forgotten something, Jack. Hmm, maybe I can help you. Yeah? How's that? So you're going to help me find some good music? For tonight, I mean? Consider it done, but... Or, but... A favor received is a favor granted. Okay, I'll get you something, Jack. I just don't know what yet. Oh, man. All right, well, Jack will... He'll, you know, it's fair. You do favors, you trade. Uh... I don't remember your name. Uh, Jeff. Talk to Jeff. Hi, Jeff. Hi, Hank. Don't call me Hanky Panky, all right? Hi, Hanky Panky. That's a lovely blouse you're wearing. Is it a new one? You know what? Fuck this guy. F fuck you, Jeff. <laughs> As if my self-esteem wasn't low enough already. Or er, it's a sweater, Jeff. Jeff ignores your reply. What's on your mind, Hanky? I'm having a party. Would you like to come? I'd love to come. But it depends. I don't know why you emphasize on the word come. On what? On your pleasing ability. I don't like where this conversation is going, Jeff. Your what? Ah. <sighs> what do you mean? What, what do you mean, my pleasing ability? I mean, can you satisfy me? Stimulate my manlyhood. Jeff, please, how old are we? I'm pretty sure this could be illegal in some states. What? Is he suggesting what I think he's suggesting? Gay alert. Now, remember, this is an older game, all right? You know, no actual shaming here. Nothing wrong with gays, all right? <laughs> Silly Jeff loves to prank. Giggle. What do you mean, prank, hanky-panky? Gay alert, gay alert. Jeff, isn't there another way to persuade you? Actually, there is. Bend over. How? Tell me. You could send your little brother over sometime. All right, let's just let's just move past that, for the love of God. But Paul's already seen someone, you lie. Well, then you'll have to come up with something else, Hank. Why bother, you wonder? Oops, I keep hitting the wrong F, F command. Jeff, coming or not? Maybe if you lend me a hand, maybe then. And if I don't? Well, then you'll have to come up with something else, Hank. 
Shut up, Michael. Here, I'll, I'll, Michael will give you a handy. Give Jeff a handy. Uh, what does that mean? Jerk off. <laughs> Look, he's asking for it, all right? Shut up, Michael. I'm trying to give a handy over here, all right? Oh, my God. All right, well... I don't think it's going to let me in any of these other ones, which also, I don't even know if I tried to open the other one. Uh, probably not, but it may not matter. Shut up, Michael. Alright, let's get the... I thank God he left me alone. Alright, so... Uh, we're about at 20 minutes here, so... Let's go ahead and... Fucking save, oh my god. I mean, on the bright side, um... What fucking part is this? <laughs> my brain. I think part th 4, right? I was gonna say 3. End of part 4. I'm sorry, I'm just... I'm distracted because I'm trying to give out handies here in the hallway. Which I'm pretty sure is illegal. Anyways, um... That's gonna go ahead and be for the... Uh, Ugh, I'm so I'm so jumbled. That's it for this one, guys. Um, we'll continue exploring the rest of the school in the next video.